Why, hello there! My name is Freckress, and welcome back to Let's Play the Dream Machine. We gotta figure out how to prove to this old woman, this old witch, that we have a predisposition of magic. So let's check out this cauldron real quick. Gigantic cauldron has been placed over an open flame. Cauldron only contains boiling water. Okay, we got herbs. Row of dried herbs hangs from the ceiling. Looks like chamomile. Wolfsbane. Anise. Anise, maybe? Aloe. Okay, so... We might be able to make a salve. But it won't let me. Can I boil an egg? Why would I want to do that? Gigantic cauldron has been placed over an open flame. Okay. Um... I'd want to do that so that I could have lunch. <laughs> Boiled egg, good stuff. Alright, so... I, I guess let's go talk to Selma, see if she can help me out. That would be my thing. Well, hold on. Can I give her a wheel? Use door with lady. Have you considered crafting some kind of cart so you can drag yourself along the ground? Frankly, yes. But I don't see any cart components lying around, do you? What about this? That's not half bad. If you find me three more wheels, I'd be much obliged. See what I can do. Three? It's really the only one I saw other than the giant water wheel. Maybe I can steal a wheel from the catapult? Dang, I don't know. I'm gonna try that real quick. Maybe maybe now that I'm looking for wheels... Ah, handles! Po two perfectly round handles. Might be useful. Oh, okay, those look like wheels. More wheels, alright, okay. Good. I gotta find the fourth one. Wherever that may be. But we're gonna go back. Go see if Selma has anything. I'll drop those off another another time. Do, 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 do. Alright. Oh, 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 lid! It's my fourth wheel, I think. Use this they use this lid for the barrel, but it might take a- make a decent wheel for a wagon. I hope they don't mind if I borrow it. Cool. I got it. Hi, Selma. In your tracksuit jacket. How's he doing? He's stable, but he lost a lot of blood during the night. He'll live, but I'm glad he I got here when I did. Uh. No, no, no. Do not. I've had enough of no power, thank you very much. Alright. We're good. We're still good. Still running. From what I hear, you've I've got you to thank for that. Think nothing of it. If you should ever come by again, you will find yourself a most welcome guest in our home. We don't have riches, but we make up for it in charm and good looks. Selma here is the jewel of the family. Between you and me, I'll have you know she's not yet spoken for. Dad! <laughs> oh, Grandpa. <laughs> Can't blame me for trying. I'm afraid I'm spoken for. See what I mean, Selma? If you want, if you wait too long, the good ones get snatched. Speaking of which, I should probably get going. You do that, son. So, did you find the Wiccan? I did. She doesn't want to teach me until I show her some sort of magical predisposition. Oh. You don't know magic? No. Do you? Of course. I know healing magic. Can you teach me that, then? That's not how it works, I'm afraid. Magical predisposition is something you're born with. Perhaps you know magic and you're just not aware of it yet? Have you ever made strange things happen with your mind? No. Perhaps you didn't even notice. Tiny display is often the first sign. Okay. What about... Maybe I'll be able to move the lily pads then. We'll see. Um, I've got enough wheels. I'm gonna do that real quick. Nope. I 
like that this is a nice big expense. Give her this wheel. Uh, what about this? That looks pretty good. If you could find two more wheels, I'd be much obliged. Okay, well, I've got two more wheels. How's that? How about these? These look pretty sturdy. Now we only need some kind of base to attach it all to. What about this wood? How about these? That's not half bad. I could build a base out of those. I can make my cart now. Finally, I'll be able to get out of here. Please accept this bow as a token of my gratitude. Thank you. I don't know why I need it, but okay. Thank you for helping me with the cart. I'll get back to my patrol at least. Speaking of which, they must be worried sick about me. I should probably get back ASAP. Okay. Let's see you around. Alright, so I'm gonna go back to the lake. See if I can do anything with that. Try moving things with my mind. Get myself a water lily. Examine lily pad. Can't reach it. it doesn't matter. Try to move it with your mind. Huh. Examine bow. Simple bow made from a single piece of wood. Can I use these? I can. It's better than nothing, I guess. What about this? Shooting at it won't accomplish much. Are you sure? Can I fish? Use bow with lake. Okay. Are you sure? Dang it! I thought I had it. I thought wrong. <laughs> Okay... Hum... What do I need to shoot? Don't want to lose the twig, there's a big hole. Okay... Dang it! Using it for something? What am I using it for? Ugh... Shoot everything. Okay, time to explore. Oh, hello. Talk to Mob. There he is. Man of the hour. Thank you for helping our scout get back to the fold. Would have been tragedy to lose her. She has the finest eye this side of the wall. Eh. Think nothing of it. Was there anything else? Report my findings. What have you found? I think the thief is hiding beyond the Great Wall. That's a useless lead. There's no way we're going to close that thing. We're going close to that thing. No way! Oh, you guys are so useless. Alright. Stay out of trouble, son. Okay. What? Can I shoot to the other side? I don't think I can. Like, I wouldn't... It wouldn't hook to anything. It would just be a twig. <laughs> Try it anyway. Since I'm here. What? Twig seems to be stuck on the other side of the wall. I'll secure the yarn on this end. There. That should hold it, hopefully. Really? <laughs> yarn seems secured on both sides, but it won't support my weight. Okay, so I go over there, and I'd be small. Come over here? Why do I want to do that? Why do I need to be small over here? I don't know. What do I need to be small over here for?
Hmm. Actually, let's see about. I forgot what was over here. Is it the graveyard? No, it's the pixie hole. Okay. I still have a bow, though. I can't combine them. Okay. <sighs> Do I need more berries? I don't need to pick any more. I've already caught the pixie. Okay. What else have I got? Oh, if I'm small, I have a magic disposition. Or if I'm able to shrink myself, I have a magic predisposition. That sounds about right. Let me let me try that. That's going to take a lot of time though. But I'll do it. It's a twig I shot from Selma's dream. Okay, gun. Then enter passage. <laughs> so surprised that that worked. <laughs> All right, walk across. It's an opening on the opposing wall. Cross void. You're really, you're really gonna make me wait this entire time. Oh fuck you. This is why I need a fast double click option. Okay, several minutes late. Okay, thank you. Good gracious. I'm like you, bitch. Where am I? Um, several minutes later. There we go. God. Enter doorway. Okay, I'm itty bitty. I'm teensy tiny. I won't have all of my other things, but I do have my gun. I'm using that on myself. And I'm going over to the witch. Oh, gracious. Even though they gave me a shortcut, like, oh, minutes later, that was still too long. <laughs> Okay. That's it, child! Seems you know magic after all. Pretty impressive stuff, I might add. What type of ingredients did you use for that potion? Rosemary and rose petals? Stuffed animal fur? Well, hold on, I'll show you. I use this gun. That's unlike anything I've seen before. Pretty sweet, huh? I don't know how you got a hold of such a thing, but I suggest you be careful with it. Fear and doubt it emanates from it. So will you teach me the, the potion you mentioned earlier? Of course, dear. But making it will be tricky. I'm out of ingredients. Figures. All the ingredients can be found here in the forest. Here, let me give you the recipe. Hooray! Come back once you've found them and I'll instruct you how to make the brew. Thanks. Alright, what do we need? Okay, so I need water lily, um, dirt from a fresh grave, dove egg, acorn, burnt limestone. Okay, well egg I know where it is, grave dirt I know where that is, water lily I know where it is, but I can't get it yet. Maybe I can use the staff to move that around. Limestone. An acorn I might be able to ask the uh, squirrel for. Okay. Gonna go ahead and get an egg. Duff has built a nest. You can see eggs in it. Yep. Take egg. I have egg. Maybe I can use the. I can. I can use the hole. The gun to go in that hole. All right. So, lily pad. Alright, lily pad. Now I can use the gun. Ha ha ha! Can't reach it. Oh, I missed one. Aha! Ok. 
Okay. Alright. Is that all I needed to do? Am I good now? Can I cross it? <laughs> Can't reach the stamen... I can reach the stamen if I separate the petals a bit. Hooray! I got me a stamen. There. Now it's going to be gigantic. <laughs> nope, okay. Maybe we'll just forget about that. Some stamen from the water lily I found at the lake. Okay, so we're just gonna ignore the size thing in this world, apparently. Go here, use gun, go in hole. Hooray! Some day of the tentacle shit. Um, let's get up here. So you finally come for me. Sorry? I surprised you managed to get past my barricade, but in a way I'm relieved. Well, what are you waiting for? Do it. Do what? Cut me open like all the others. Take what you came for, then leave me alone. I intend to sleep through this era, and the one after. You got it all wrong. I'm not the organ thief. Then what are you doing here? Another gloater here to mock and jest. Leave me to be molested in peace. My name is Victor Neff. I'm not here to mock you. I've come to stop the organ thief. Oh dear. Just what the world needs. Another hero. Who are you? My name is Jerome. At least it used to be. I don't know what people call me these days. Probably something unflattering. What are you doing? Hiding here until the trouble lies down. <laughs> dies down? My kind always gets persecuted when people start losing their limbs. Your kind? I'm a vampire, Victor. Don't be alarmed. I'm too weak to move during hibernation. I couldn't hurt you even if I wanted to. In fact, you're safer in here with me. Out there, neither the thief will get you, or the lynch moms will. But I've erected a barricade to keep people out. You're welcome to share this hut with me. I understand if you don't want to, though. Most people consider my presence to be unsettling. Wow, what's it like being a vampire? Immortality is not what you might think. After a while, you feel as though you've seen everything before. People start merging into an indistinguishable lump of petty needs and petty problems. That sounds awful. That's why I hibernate through most of it. When will you come out of hibernation? When times are better, in a century or two. Every once in a while, an era comes along where I feel at home. A moment in time where truly new ideas are welcome. That's when I leave my hiding place and start living again. Those moments are very rare, though. What's wrong with this era? Sages for small-minded, dead-eyed thinkers. For clock watchers and bean counters. Insect minds with insect agendas. What makes you think we're safe in here? I barricaded the entrance so no one can get in. And nobody knows I'm here, so they won't come here looking. What about me? You have an honest face, Victor. I'm sure you won't tell anyone. Managed to get through the barricade. You cheated. I saw you use some kind of magical artifact. I doubt there's many of those around. It's If that's what it takes to get in, I figure we're pretty safe. Notice your weak, a weakness in your barricade. Really? There's a, there's a hole in the roof of this place. I saw that earlier. I didn't think it was big enough per for a person to get it through. It looked big enough to me. You're just trying to make me feel insecure. I believe I'm safe here until you prove otherwise. I'm trying to stop the organ thief. How are you going to do that? I don't know yet. If only I knew where he'd strike next. Maybe I could ambush him or something. Sounds like a good way to get maimed. Alright, bye. Don't tell anyone I'm in here. Okay. Sausages. Cup. Some moldy sausages have been left on the floor. Somebody left a cup here. It's got huge cracks in it from years of use. Alright. Salmon barricade. Pile of furniture forms a makeshift barricade. It's a lot stronger than it looks. Can't even budge this chair. I would imagine not. The wards took me three days to create. Ah, magic. Alright. 
kiln. It's an old kiln. Ash and powder covers the bottom. If I'm not mistaken, it's burnt limestone. Hooray! That was the reason I needed to come in here. Just what I need. Okay, so we found a few of the ingredients, and I think I need... I, I, I'm... I need the grave dirt, and I think I need the acorn, and then I'm done. So I'll do those in the next episode. So thank you very much for joining me. Check out annotations for other videos that I've done. Share, subscribe, and socialize, and all the other fun stuff in the YouTubes down there. Hopefully I'll see you in my next video, and my prickly face is out of here. Bye.